Andrew. And I'm Nicola, and today we are trying tacos in San Diego because that is where we live. And you will ask us to do this. We are indeed. And as Brits that live here now, we really need to get accustomed to what food is available around here. Yes. And if you watch to the very end, we're going to be ranking the food from best to mm, not sure it'd ever come back. So it might be worth watching to the very end. We are already back. We you know are. <laughs> and we are at Morisco's El Gusto X. We are. And we are having seafood here because that's what they specialize in. And this place is one of the top 10 taco places in California. So I'm really excited to try this. And this is a food trip. But unfortunately, they have run out of octopus. Which is your favorite, isn't it? it you is. love octopus, I so. I do. So I'm a little sad about that. But he gave us some other recommendations. Yes, we have two or three or four even coming, I yeah. think. So I'm yeah. looking forward to these. Yeah. Certainly not had two of these before, so. And the food has arrived. It really has not Wow. This, this is a monster portion of it food. It really is. And I am so excited because yes. I love seafood. Yes, this looks delicious. I'm going to try that. I'm just going to... This fish, look at the size of it. So, we also got some salsas as well. Oh, so, yeah. I don't know if you want to try it without first and then try it with after. Yeah, or it's got the thing. shredded cabbage in there, the onions. That oh. looks delicious. Mm. And my mouth is watering watching you eat mm. <laughs> This looks delicious. Mm -hmm. And mm. this is sizable, isn't it? This is big. This may be controversial, but is battered fish better than battered chicken? Ooh, I'd love you know, to see the answers in the comment because, section for this one. You know, which one are you a fan of? The fish, battered fish or battered chicken? Deep fried, because you know, Ooh, with fish, look at look how juicy that is. That's been fried that and the fun. fish just gets better. We were advised to try this um, this one here, apparently specifically with the fish taco. So put a little bit of this salsa on. Do you actually know what this one is? He may have said have an arrow, but it's just I digress. Carry on. <laughs> okay, so we've got a random sauce. Mm. Is that good? Mm. It was right. I didn't wrong. think it would get any better. With that sauce, it just yeah, brings little... out more flavour. Mm. A little bit of a kick to it, isn't it? But not a massive, not like the other ones that punched you in the face. <laughs> This one is the gobernator. It's this got, has got. I can't, how, where does it? Where does it actually start? That is huge. These are tacos, not burritos. Tacos, yeah, that is huge. And that has shrimps and peppers and onions on it. That looks. See, I have never that. said this before, but I don't know if my mouth is big enough. I, I, I'm <laughs> sure. I'm sure you'll survive. <laughs> you like nearly choked. You nearly choked then. Look at that. That is a monster. Wow. That really did take all of the work. Oh. Oh. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Now the cheese mm. is holding that all together, I think, because mm -mm. that looks that looks delicious. I'm not gonna try and get it all in one. That is delicious. It is delicious. There's avocado in there. There's cheese. There's peppers. There's, uh, there's everything. The prawns are good as well. The prawns, yeah. the shrimp, shrimp yeah. are so good. Oh my goodness. So what we've got going on here is the spicy shrimp. And the way that they've done it is they've put a little spicy shrimp on the top. Yeah. And a little garlic shrimp on the and top. And that is the garlic shrimp. So should I go for the other one? You can do. I'm not going to stop you. Ooh, ooh. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> now these are almost too filled to eat, if that's ever a bad thing. Never a bad thing. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> mm. That's delicious. And I don't know if anybody's noticed all day that watches our videos regularly. You have noticed a couple of things. Lots of these tacos have cheese on them. They do. But it's and lots of them. But it's melted. It's melted. <laughs> and lots of them have tomato. And not once have we complained. No. I'm not sure if it's because it's, it's cut into pieces. You can't really see it. That, and it's cut into pieces, and it's all mixed in. So, maybe we're getting over our, maybe our palates are expanding, we're getting mm. over our tomato phobia. So, wash it down with a 
Mexican style Coca-Cola. And the reason it's Mexican style, if you didn't know, is because they use cane sugar in their Coca-Cola. So it is actually um, native to Mexico, isn't it? You it can't is. get this in the US. Well, we're in the US, so how do you, you get it? You can get it in the US. Oh. They don't make it here, I don't think. Oh, did I just no. lie then? You, well, I don't know why. <laughs> I just stretch, making, stretch the truth making my own truth up. <laughs> Can't get it here. Okay. Oh, but we are in San Diego. Yeah, apart, oh. from, apart from the one I'm drinking right now. <laughs> Sounds far more dramatic. Mm. Anyway. So, of all of these, uh -huh. what was your favourite? Oh, God, they were all so good. Did you like the way you say, which one did you like the best? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I think. It's, it's like trying to choose which one of your children you like the most, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> and you can't do that either. Yeah. I think. It might have to be this one, the Gobernator, because it had everything on it. It's got avocado, cheese, shrimp, peppers, red and green. I think this one. That's definitely the, the most complete with all of the different things, what? but I quite like the simple one of the prawn. A nice garlic simple. Why am I laughing at that? We now have a birria taco. Yes, we do. But the only reason we have this is because we're going to compare and contrast. <laughs> that's the excuse. That's a great excuse. It is, isn't it? Did, did you like that? Let's stick to that. It's yeah, only really professional, didn't it? It did, yes. Did not sound like I just fancied a birria taco. This is a compare and test thing. Of course it not is. Not to do with the fact that it's birria. Oh, so this one has got cheese, birria, onion, that. and it's a double double oh, layer yeah, taco so this delicious. outer edge is crispy again and the un the inside one is soft and the gentleman that was serving us said that they're famous for their birria as well as as well as their seafood which we weren't aware of until uh, recently that looks delicious and it's huge isn't it big oh my goodness i'm gonna try the meat on itself first i just want to just dive in it's oh. so good oh, it wow. is so good I think I'm really liking the crispy taco shell. And it's not massively crispy, it's just like seared, isn't it? With the mm. soft under, so it's like a double layer. How good is that? That meat's so tender. And juicy mm. and tasty. And the cheese, it's like a mm. mozzarella. It's like a Mexican cheese, isn't mm. it? The only thing I'm missing is the consomme the dipping sauce. to dip it. Because I think with that, it would be and to be fair, we didn't ask if they had that, so that might no, be our fault. Look at that. Yeah, we didn't ask for that. So, what are you doing? <laughs> and we are back. We are, and where are we? We're at La Central in San Diego. We are, and we are having birria tacos. <laughs> Here we go. Ooh, look at that. Thank you. As if my magic. Uh, uh, for you guys. Thank you. I am so excited right now. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. What did we, what have so we... So this one is a handmade tortilla with cheese. It's yeah. a pesa taco. Yeah. yeah. This one is a regular taco. Yeah. Yeah. And this one, the, the difference between these three. Yeah. This one, the, the meat is here. Oh, you see it. Yeah. Okay, yeah. And this one, it's a crispy tortilla with cheese. It's some grilled onions and grilled jalapenos. Mm -hmm. It smells and then, delicious. I'm assuming we're supposed to dip this into here. You can dip it or you can pour a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Like this. Or oh, okay. you can eat it. Yeah. And at the same time, you can wipe it up and then sip the consomme. Right. Wow. And the idea is to have both on the same time. Okay. Yeah. The taco and the broth. Okay. Thank you. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Thank you. Please. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Just in case we probably will. Thanks. Okay. Oh wow. Look at that. Okay, so we set. There's a number of ways to do this. Mm. Are you okay, Dad? No. Because that tortilla is so soft. Let me try that one. It's so soft. The cheese. Oh, wow. It's How melted. Oh, when you eat it, the cheese is melted. The seasoning in there, it's so juicy and so well seasoned. I feel like I say that every time. Oh, well wow. seasoned. That is so juicy. Yeah. And it has. You're meant to have. And we didn't even have this. I did. Wow. You missed me having it. And. Oh, wow. The cheese. This is so rich, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, wow. It's wow, like wow, a wow, really wow. rich, salty broth, isn't it? I, could, just, I oh. did. 
So this one is really jumping out at me here. This oh, one that's got there. No. I'm going in. I'm going in. I'm going in. I'm just keep drinking this. I've grown a backbone oh, oh. today. <laughs> so this one is seared, and it was basically, um, they put it onto the hot plate after just to put the, like a, cr a crust on the top. They did. That looks really good. Yeah, it does. Oh, so it's very, very hot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, one of us has got really unsensitive heat fingers, and it was not, ha <laughs> ha. I do. So you've missed a trick already though, because we're supposed to put the onions and stuff on there. I'm going to put some extra onions. The flavour just explodes. It explodes. It is, I mean, it's already got onions on it. It's already got all of this stuff on it. It is so good. That is amazingly good. And because the meat is crispy in there, it's still soft and tender and stewed. But well, the meat has also got crispy bits in there. You, the, the crisp on the top of that is yeah. just... You can try a bit of the meat. That is delicious. It is so good. This one, the turkey one. This one, mm. the turkey feels like it's being crisped. You see that? It's like a double yeah. taco. And it's like it's been... So it's almost like... The, it's been seared on the... Two, so I could have some. Mm. And if you notice all of the juice dripping out the other end, that is so delicious. Right, you can try that one. Well, so this is just a regular meat. one. And you did say you can drink this with it, or you can dip this in here as well. If that's what you want to do. I feel like this is... Uh-oh. Mm. You're, like, you're getting all the juice all over these, darling. Mm. We've got this one back here. That is so good, isn't it? Because mm. it's got a crispy tortilla yeah. shell. And oh. all the this one goes a step further. This is all crispy. All crispy. So you need to try that one. Oh, wow. And this one has, oh, this has the peppers on it. That's delicious. This has I could, peppers. I could just drink that. I, well, I have been. Mm. This has peppers on it. And onions. And onions. Cilantro. Mm. Guess who's not a fan of so much? That'd be me. Mm. <laughs> Oh, move down. Mm. Mm. And the crispiness on the outside of this is mm. lovely. Oh, the, mm. the melted cheese hanging out. Mm. So good. So, of all of the four, which was your favourite? I think. It has to be this one. The third one, I think. The third one, because it had it had like different textures to it. Yeah. They all taste fantastic, phenomenal. Yeah. You're not disappointed with any of them. No. But I think the crispy one, just because of the difference in textures, that would be my favourite. Yeah. Anyway, out of the four, that one definitely. Anyway, we're just going to finish all these off. Yeah. And then on to the next one. On to the next one. And we are back. We are, and we have four tacos from the Cabeza El Unico. Oh. Easy for you to say. <laughs> Which basically <laughs> means head only yes. in English. So, And this has got to be the most interesting group of tacos I've ever had. Because we thought we had to have all of the head bits. And we got the recommendation from the server who I think was also the owner. Yeah. Um, so what did we get? We got head. Head <laughs> meat. We did get head meat. We. Got... <laughs> <laughs> Every time, we got, every time you say that. We got, um, let's gloss over that, pork belly. Not that one. That was the pork belly. Yeah, and then we <laughs> got beef, no, cheek. I'm assuming it's beef cheek, I don't know. But the cheek actually looks what I thought would have been the pork belly, but it's not. Mm. And then we got another one that's like a magical mystery one. I think he said it was chorizo and something. Oh, he did. Chorizo, uh, but I think there's a mixture in there of something else. You're going for... The pork belly. I'm going to try this one. Mmm. Mmm. Oh wow. Mmm. I think all I'm gonna say today is everything is so well seasoned. That has a kick to it. That one is kicking me, but not that, that one is delicious. That is, try that that is pork really belly, good. Then, if you think mm. that's delicious, I'm gonna <clears throat> That's got a definite kick to it, but it's so... <laughs> Has that one got a kick too? <laughs> that might have just kicked in a little. <laughs> that was a head. Mmm, yes. Mm. 
Mmm. And if people are wondering why we're in the cart, because it was too loud in there for us mm. to film. The music, they were having a party. It was almost like there was a mariachi band sat at the end of the table. It really was, and it's great party party vibe. Yes, not, yeah. Not great for you lot trying to watch us. Oh, this one looks really fatty. That does look like it's got a lot of fat on the meat there, doesn't it? Oh. I Is bet it you, belly you would like or that. tripe, do you think? Mm. Mm. Oh. <laughs> mm-mm. That is really fatty. I love it because I yeah, love fat. So one. I'm not a big fan of the fattier meats. So I'm gonna probably not this hasn't made me excited, I'm gonna be honest, but let's try. No. I'm not sure if it's fat or tripe, I don't know. Mm. And this is the, all of them look similar in colour apart mm -hmm. from this one which has got it's a orange. lot more of an orangey tint to it, which I'm assuming yeah. is ch the chorizo side of it, is it? And it had a tangy flavour to it too. It's delicious, but there's a tang, mm. like a, a... I like that a lot. Yeah. Well, you like vinegary tangy, tangy. Mm. I think. So the question is, mm. which one's your favourite? So the head meat wasn't nearly as scary as it sounds, and it was actually very tasty. Yes. The pork belly one, that we think is pork belly. Yeah. Was really tasty. Yeah. But my standout favourite, I think, is the orange one. Okay, well mine is, the, whatever this one is, they said pork belly. I don't think that's pork belly. I think that's pork belly. Yeah. This one, the first one that I bit into, mm. is my favourite. But we've got more to eat. Yes. So we're off to the next one. On to the next one. This is Trafos El Gordo. Now this place is famous because it came from TJ, Tijuana, over to San Diego. And it's been open 40 plus years. Wow. And there's about five of them, I believe. There's, there's one in five. Vegas. Really? Yes. So we're going to try this place. They're famous for Al Pastor. And we are back again. We are. Um, not quite sure what we got, because it was a bit of a nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> we got a sada, a sada, and then we got um, Al Pastor, didn't nope. we? No. Completely wrong. Oh no. <laughs> Completely wrong. <laughs> what did you This is Al Pastor and this is Al Pastor. Yeah. And this is Carne Asada. Okay. But well... apart from that, <laughs> you were exactly right in what we got, just in the wrong order. Right. Yes. And it's meant to be the most authentic you can get in Tijuana. Now, oh. of course, if you want to see us go over to Mexico and try Tijuana, just let us know because we're happy to do that. But this, mm. uh, I'm, I'm just talking. Mm, carry okay. on. Ah. Don't mind me. So mm, mm. this Al Pastor comes straight mm. off the, they call it a trumper? <laughs> That's what they call it, I think. The, the, the big circular meat mm -hmm. thing. I think that's what they call it. I know what you're talking about. Um, and they carve it oh. off straight in front of you, don't they? It's yeah. delicious. They, I think we call it gyro, gyro. Mm. Do the same sort of thing. But this... Now all of, these are the smallest tacos we've had. These are street tacos. Right, okay. Mm. Good point, well made. The meat in this is delicious. And it comes with that, it's double mm. tortilla. So what I have been known to do is split it and get two out of one. Two yeah. Out of and oh, it's crispy. No. The tortilla shell is crisp, a little crispy. Mm. Mm. And inside, mm -hmm. it's a little bit like a canteen, isn't it? Mm. You kind of go from one end to the other and stop at different mm -hmm. sections and pick up different types of food. Mm -hmm. Interesting. That is delicious. Though. It is nice, that, isn't it? Mmm. I just had the meat on its own. Mm. Well seasoned, isn't it? Mm hmm. I feel like I don't need to tell people. No. It's going to be well seasoned. Yeah. It's just like a given. Mm. Unless I mention it's bland. <laughs> Moving on. Oh, sorry. Was I rabbiting too much? And you get quite a lot of meat on these things, don't you? Oh, look at the, look at that. Oh, the avocado, darling. Do you want to go first? I'm not going to say no. Oh, we, we can discuss it or decide between us. Or no. you can just go first. How does that but sound? You don't like avocado, so I'm doing you a favour. I'm not the world's <laughs> biggest fan of avocado. That might be controversial. It's sat here with that mound of avocado on it. <laughs> 
got a charred grill mm. taste to it. It does. It's really smoky taste to it. Mm -hmm. Try it on its own. It's, it's got oh. a really smoky barbecue type flavour to it, I think. Yeah, you taste it all mm. together and I'll taste it on its own, but it is so... The meat is so soft and juicy. And also, it's charred grilled. It's a whole lot of that. Oh, it's delicious. It is so good. Eat it all together. Oh. And it's like this taste explosion is going on. <gasps> Is, I wish I'd have got two of those. Mm. How good is that? No. That is so good. Mm. So, I think I've just given away which one my favourite is, but which one's your favourite? Um, I think probably the, the carne asada is the better of the two. Mm. Uh, the smoky mm. flavour to that is just really nice, I think. Mm -hmm. Although I'm not, this one's not upsetting me either. No. I'm but, not upset by any of them. No, but. but this is my... If I had to choose just one, it would be this one. Anyway. On to the next one. So, I have a question for you. Okay. Which one is your ultimate favourite? Very hard, because I've enjoyed all of them. Should we do a countdown reveal it? Yes, do that. Okay. So basically, the, if you had to choose one to go to first, yeah. which one would it be? Yeah. On three. Two, one... Last food truck. truck. Oh. And I, I wouldn't disagree with you if you said let's go with the food truck first. I, I what, feel Why would you choose this one? Because I love seafood. Okay. And that is the only reason. Oh. I feel like the, I love seafood. I can eat fried fish, grilled fish, octopus, shrimp all day long. I love birria too. Mm -hmm. But so why would you choose the birria? I love the little bowl of consomme or broth. Okay with the birria tacos that we had. I just, yeah. I, I loved the one that had been seared. I thought that was really nice. Yes. I couldn't not come back here again. This was delicious and the birria from here was equally as good. Yes. And as you say, it's difficult to choose because fish and birria are two different things. Yes. Yeah. So on that basis, we should have two winners. Yes. Birria. Yes. And this food truck. Yes. Until next time. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. And if you want to watch another video of us eating stuff, click here. Other stuff, because we've eaten other stuff. Yeah. yeah. Click here. Yeah. Or there. Or there. It might be here or there.